Former Ziegler City Treasurer Ryan Thorpe was sentenced to four years in federal prison in June after pleading guilty to stealing more than $320,000 from the city. But new documents obtained by News 3 show the price tag of Thorpe's theft could be tens of thousands of dollars higher. Credit card statements show a City of Ziegler credit card, which multiple city officials confirm was in Thorpe's possession, racked up at least $20,000 in non-city expenses from 2013 to 2017, ranging from fast food meals to family vacations in Florida. It makes me feel like uh, government has failed our community. Jamie Moyers, who was appointed Ziegler Finance Commissioner in March, went through hundreds of suspicious transactions with News 3. $900 at Best Buy in Carbondale in December. <laughs> Sounds like a Christmas gift, doesn't it? Among the most egregious expenses, more than $1,000 spent at a resort in Panama City Beach, Florida. No, that's an illegitimate purchase. Photos posted to Facebook show that Thorpe and his family, along with Ziegler Street Commissioner Jim Flood, vacationed in Panama City Beach at the time of the charges. Flood declined an on-camera interview, but provided credit card documents showing he had paid for his own room at the hotel. Ziegler Mayor Dennis Mitchell says the discovery of the new charges is frustrating for a city trying to move on from the theft. Who was getting those statements? Those would have been gone through the treasurer. And was someone supposed to review those? Those probably should have been reviewed in the finance department with all the other invoices. Flood, who was finance commissioner while Thorpe was treasurer, says he didn't know Thorpe was using a city credit card for personal purposes. Flood added he didn't look over credit card statements because he trusted the treasurer, something he regrets looking back. The credit card statements show more than $10,000 spent at Walmart over the four-year span. One Walmart receipt found in Thorpe's office following an FBI raid last August shows what seems to be a Thanksgiving dinner, complete with a four-pound ham, cranberry sauce, and yams, paid for on the city card. Yeah, that's a, that's, that's a Thanksgiving dinner. The card was also charged for more than $400 worth of knives in Tennessee, $900 on Hotels.com, and almost $500 for RV parts. Moyers says Ziegler has since canceled the credit card, though it still owes about $400 on the account. Mayor Mitchell adds the city has opened an investigation and will be reaching out to businesses to obtain receipts and other information about the charges. In Ziegler, Andrew Feather, News 3.